Welcome to morning prayer for November 22nd through 26, coming up to the first Sunday of Advent. And we'll start by joining together in a responsive reading of Psalm 25. I'm following in your footsteps, my Savior. I trust in you. Do not mislead me. Don't draw me into difficulties where others can crow over my humiliation. Let those who are sneaky and devious make fools of themselves, God, but I do not want to be one of them. I want to be like you. Hold my hand while I learn to walk. Your way is founded on love and faithfulness. Those who walk with you learn from you. And so I'll read our scripture passage three times, Lectio Divina style. So I'll leave a short pause uh, for the first reading, just listen. For the second reading, listen for a word or phrase that stands out for you. And the third reading, uh, take that phrase or word uh, to take you deeper into prayer. Our scripture lesson today is from 1 Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 11. May God and our Master Jesus clear the road to you. And may the Master pour on the love so that it fills your lives and splashes over on everyone around you. May you be infused with strength and purity and filled with confidence in the presence of God. May God and our Master Jesus clear the road to you. And may the Master pour on the love so that it fills your lives and splashes over on everyone around you. May you be infused with strength and purity and filled with confidence in the presence of God. May God and our Master Jesus clear the road to you. And may the Master pour on the love so that it fills your lives and splashes over on everyone around you. May you be infused with strength and purity and filled with confidence in the presence of God. And now join me in a responsive prayer. Lead us not into temptation, we pray. Don't draw us into difficulties, says the psalmist. O oh God, we admit we are drawn into difficulties. The way forward doesn't always seem clear to us. We stray, we stop, we even turn back. Help us, God, to sense your presence even in the midst of difficulties and problems. Help us to sense your hand holding us, your wisdom guiding us, your love filling us with the courage and confidence we need to meet whatever life sends us. O oh God, even as we contemplate our difficulties, we realize that we are not alone. There are many in the world and in our community who are suffering in many ways. Today and every day we bring them into your presence and hear us as we pray for them now in silence. Hear our prayers, O God, and in your love answer. Amen. Please pray with me. God bless each one of us. As we travel on, in our times of need, may we find a table spread in the wilderness and companions on the road. Amen. Amen. <laughs> 